Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I am in my garage. I just got home from work and I was like, you know what, I want to paint the rest of my garage because so all of it is black. You guys can't tell already. It's all black. But the garage door we left white and now I'm like, wait, when I do my posing here in the mirror, which I'll show you guys. So when I pose here, because I do my posing in here, I have my posing mirror up there as well. But you can see the white background. Now you'll be able to see my full silhouette because you're you're usually supposed to pose up against um, a black, you know, curtain or something. So I'm lucky enough that I get to pose in my garage. So I'm like, why not just paint the whole garage black? Also, we have something very special coming this week. I'm so excited for this to be in here. So I just need more room on this side. So we're gonna get rid of this whole squat rack and then move my bike and my treadmill in and then something very special is gonna go in that corner where the treadmill is, so stay tuned for that. I'm gonna keep painting. My dad's actually helping me. He went to the store really quick, so I'm just like painting my laugh away right now. Fun fact, I actually grew up listening to um, Mexican and Latin music. So my favorite artist is John Sebastian. He passed away a couple of years ago, but all of his songs are freaking bangers <laughs> in, in like a Mexican world, you know? How is this not a banger? What's up YouTube, it is now a couple days later. Finally finished the entire garage door. It looks amazing, so I wanted to hop on here and show you guys. Ta-da! Look at how cute! So this is what I mean. Now you can actually see my full silhouette with the black background versus the white background. So I'm so excited to be posing in here, but today is a big, big day because we are getting a very special delivery, which you guys will be here for that. So I'm not gonna spoil it just yet, but here in a couple of hours, we will have something brand new in this lovely space right here. That's why I got rid of, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I got rid of the squat rack just because in 2020, yes, it was a great addition to the garage. However, now I, we don't really use it that much. So I'd rather use up the space for something else that I really, really want. So that's what we did. Jacob is so funny. He's like, let's hope COVID-19 2.0 doesn't happen again and you don't need that. Um, but luckily I actually sold it to a neighbor down the street and I actually helped him carry the whole squat rack all the way over to his house. So I know where it's at. So. Julius, if you're in on my YouTube, I will be coming over to use that squat rack if COVID happens again. But um, anyways, we just cleaned this up. Well, I did yesterday. I spent like three hours in here yesterday cleaning the entire garage up because like I said, we have something special coming today and I can't wait, you guys. You haven't seen this excitement from me because I haven't been this excited in quite some time. So. Um, I'll catch you guys up once it's here, but for right now I'm going to do a little bit of cardio, get some work done, shower, change, hopefully by then, it's here. The sauna is here. My sauna is here. So it is from the brand Sunlight, and I have done quite some research on all the saunas out there. Once I weighed out all the pros and cons of all of them, this one was superior to any other brand. So if you guys are interested in getting your own, message me on Instagram, and then I will help you get your own. No, I didn't get this for free, but if you guys wanted to get a sauna for yourself and invest in yourself, then definitely let me know because I can help you out and maybe we can give you a good little discount. So with that being said, 
We are left with two huge boxes. We're gonna wait for my dad to get here, obviously, because I definitely can't do that on my own, but we will figure it out later. Maybe we get to try it out tonight. As you guys saw, we installed my sauna last night. Once I get home, I will show you guys the sauna and how it looks. It's freaking amazing. But um, we just pulled up to Savage Fitness. We are actually training with Ashley Gomez. She is a fire trainer. I've known her for years. Now she's training here, so obviously I'm here every day. She's here every day, so we get to see each other and hang out. Um, but we've worked out once before together, and I actually really, really enjoyed it. I'm about to go get warmed up, then hit legs with her so i'm really excited i'm gonna take you guys along with me for this workout Timer. all right i'm putting ashley through my 10 by 10 so we are about to start all right you could just go for your 10 now <sighs> it's already burning 10 more seconds. I'm telling you, they don't turn off. One more. And then we're switching. It's 10 by 10. Welcome to my workout. She thinks I'm crazy making her do 10 by 10. But that's what I like to do. I like to do heavy. Heavy hip thrust one day, high volume hip thrust another leg day, and then just like accessorize with any hip thrust movement on the third leg day. Uh, all right, let's go, last one. Nice. How's your first 10 by 10? We've moved on to some Romanian that looks and it's extending them with some glute bridges. Dude, your ass looks fucking insane. I don't even know if I could try to add on weight. I would, like I would. Band? Can you see how many five bands on there? Yeah. You wanna try it? Wait, let's do that because at the top it's gonna be really hard. Six. Seven. Eight. Yeah. yeah. Doing our burnout supersets, so we decided on doing kickbacks, and then I'll show you guys in a minute what we're supersetting with. But oh yeah, my glutes are feeling it. So Brett Contreras posted a Q&A the other day, and someone asked a good question and said, "What is the most underrated glute exercise?" And he posted a video of this specific movement. We we'll call it like a single leg deficit hip thrust. Lift one leg, closing the clamshell, and then opening at the top. Driving through the entire foot of the standing leg. Honestly, this is a great finisher. 
Yeah, literally that's it. All right, you guys, that was one for the books. We obviously took our time because um, she actually had a big break today. So it was perfect timing for us to actually get a lift in. But aside from that, um, we're just girls. We were talking, we were chatting it up and we both have really similar interests, which makes it a lot easier to, you know, hang out with somebody and get a good workout in. Cause um, we're just like shooting around ideas all with like training, being healthy, um, which is really cool. So I loved my time with Ashley. Ashley, love you girl. We will get many more workouts in. Um, I love that we have about the same strength. She's probably a little bit stronger than me, honestly. I mean, she got glutes for days, but um, I like that I can keep up with her and she can keep up with me. Like that makes it so much more fun. So that was an amazing workout. Now we're gonna rush home because guess what? we get to use our sauna for the very first time and I'm so excited which is so freaking cool that I can turn it on from my phone so it's already pretty preheating for me by the time I get home I'm just popping in there and going about my sauna session so I'm so excited about that so I will catch you guys at home once I'm in my sauna ah! all right you guys are back home but I remembered that I actually got some packages from sunlight in um, I have some accessories that I can use inside of the sauna so I'm gonna go ahead and open those up before we get into the sauna but it's really cool because I got a text message or a notification on my phone because I had set it um, to be ready by like 10 20 and um, it said your sauna is now at the desired temperatures all right, here's the big packages I got a body wrap by the Salient fabric. So this fabric, so I didn't know, but cotton or polyester or any other type of fabric, it um, stops the wavelengths from actually reaching your body. It's a lot harder to penetrate um, to your body's like core temperature. So this new technology, I can wear this in there safely and it'll penetrate through. So that's really, really cool. This is a wrap. I probably won't be doing the wrap today and then I got a salient um, cushion cover because I actually got a cushion so we don't have to sit on the plain old wood seating. Oh yeah, this is my backrest so you can safely lean up against it. But I'm realizing I didn't get my actual cushion. I'm missing my cushion so I gotta tell them to send me that. Maybe I'll use this to sit on for today since I don't have the actual cushion. I was supposed to get a cushion as well but that's all right, but it's ready to go for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up in there. You can see it, but let me turn on the lights in here. Ooh, she's hot. There we go. Let's make it the red light. How cool, so I have this little remote and I can do whatever light I want. Green, blue, there's even like different hues of each color which is cool I'm gonna do red red and then I can also control the music from my phone which is so freaking cool so I'm gonna set my towel down so that I can sit and then I'm gonna go get my backrest and then start my session how beautiful is it though we love it my gosh every inch of me is sweating like even my freaking thoughts that was so nice i'm so grateful that i'm able to have this right in my home now i just get to come down and get into my sauna which is honestly probably the most amazing thing now i am starving because we had a rough leg day we did a full sauna session 45 minutes so now we are ready to eat for sure so i'm gonna rinse off first though because this is a little gross and then i'll eat so i'll catch you guys later 
What is up, you guys? It is now around lunchtime, and I have a really good friend. His name is Zach. He just partnered with Waba Grill here in Las Vegas, and he said to come on by and try some of their meals so that I can show you guys. So I'm here. I just pulled up. Um, I don't really know what to expect, but we're going in there. going to try to shoot a little bit of content for y'all and try the meals. So we'll see how this goes. This is the outside. Look at how cute. ¿Qué tipo de um, aceite usas? Oh, wow. Okay. Si todo, todo eso a la plancha, okay. Wow, o sea, qué perfecto. Porque no me gusta ir mucho a comer porque siempre usan como canola oil, vegetable oh, oil. Okay. Y eso no es y bueno para ti. Es so. Wow. Es Wow, okay, qué bueno. I was honestly kind of nervous about, you know, the oils because a lot of restaurants will use inflammatory oils. However, they just tell me that they actually don't use any oil at all. It goes from the grill straight to the plate, which is amazing. The veggies are steamed and then they do white rice. I feel safe enough to eat any of this, so I'm excited to try all this. We'll see how the meals turn out. You guys, look at this. This is amazing. Zach, thank you so much for hooking it up. Your girl is set for the week. Let's do a taste test. Which one should we have, y'all? I really want to try the steak, to be honest. Ooh, this steak. That looks so good. Look at this. This is the salmon bowl straight from the grill onto the plate. I absolutely love that. This is their uh, shaved um, ribeye and then it has a little bit of sauce. You can ask for the sauce on the side, which they didn't do, but that's okay. Steamed veggies and then a bed of white rice on the bottom. And then I also got, oh, I wish my babe was here because he loves himself some shrimp. So we got the shrimp. This is the chicken with the white rice and the steamed veggies. Thank you so much again, Waba Grill in Vegas. It is off of St. Rose and like, Maryland area. I can already see the quality in this food. So I'm actually gonna dig in and give you guys a little car taste test because a little AS ASMR never hurt nobody. Mmm. Oh, that smells so good. I'm actually really hungry right now. I didn't want to do it in there because there's some people in there and I'm like, I want to do it in the comfort of my car. Mmm. He wasn't lying, so he said, way better than Teriyaki Madness, and it for sure is. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So if you ever need some meals on the go, check out Waba Grill, because they don't use any bad ingredients. Eris approves. She definitely approves. Thanks so much, Zach, again, and Waba Grill for getting me these bowls to try. Um, I'll definitely be coming back and picking up meals for whenever I don't want to cook because this makes it a lot easier. Look at me. Just dig it in. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get home, get some work done, and I will catch you guys later.